Hey hi this is Mr Sekoder here today i'm going to explain the solution to a google kickstart 2020 round c it's a fourth problem name it candies let's see the problem statement first and then dive into the solution so the problem statement is like this a call has an array of n candies the ith element of an array it's a one indexed array represents the sweetness value of i candy you would like to perform a series of queue operations there are two types of operations the update operation and query operation in the update operation he'll give you the index with uh, of i candy you need to update that uh, sweetness value to a specific value given in the query he will he will ask you he will give you the l and r you need to get the score sweetness score of that sub array so the sweetness score is defined in this way so if you given uh, l and r then the sweetness score is defined as a of i a of l into 1 and uh, a of l plus 1 into minus 2 a of l plus uh, uh, 2 into 3 a of l plus 3 into minus 4 uh, so on more formally this can be represented as this so if you look at the example if this is uh, the sub array that you have taken then uh, the uh, the score sweetness score is calculated in this way 3 into 1 1 into minus 2 6 into 3 similarly others so if the call is interested in finding out the total sum of sweetness score of all the queries he, ha- he has asked it so if no no query operation then sum is considered to be zero so we can do this with the help of uh, fin victories let's dive into the solution let's look at the solution we define two fin victories ft1 and ft2 in the first fin victory we store um, the sum in this way a of 1 minus a of 2 plus a of 3 it will store the ray sum in ranges in this way in the fin victory 2 we store uh, as uh, a of 1 into 1 minus a of 2 into 2 a of 3 into 3 like that so if you ask it for a range of uh, 3 to 5 let's say then what you can do is you can get the sum of this fin victory second fin victory and uh, you can reduce uh, the sum of uh, uh, first fin victory into l minus 1 so you can get the actual sum as uh, required as well this is a sweetness score required so there is a problem here if uh, since we are storing uh, the odd indices as a uh, positive and even indices as negative so uh, if the query is starting with a if the query is a uh, left range is uh, even index given index then we need to uh, we need to get the sweetness score in this way here uh it's nothing but uh, minus of the actual result that you get so let's dive into the implementation here is a fin victory yeah uh, here is a fin victory that you can see let's uh, it's also called as a binary index tree here uh, the add operation is so this is common for every fin fin victory in the sum of range it will be given in this way so the update uh, query would take if if uh, this is the odd index then we'll multiply as 1 with multiply the actual value that you need to update with with 1 if this is even index we'll multiply with minus 1 so uh, in the second uh, fin victory we are actually multiplying with the values also so that is we should multiply with the id also Uh, similar uh, if this is odd index we'll multiply with 1 or if in, even index then we'll multiply with minus 1 so let's uh, look at the query of if you given this range you, you actually subtract from f2 fin victory 2 minus uh, l minus 1 into the fin victory 1 range sum if this is odd uh, since we are we need to multiply with 1 if this is even we need to multiply with minus 1 So here we read the value. Initially, we update uh, with the fin, update the fin victory with the given or uh, input values. 
and uh, we'll uh, for for in order to keep track of for the query sum of all the query ranges we will declare this uh, query sum variable and store this so if the query type is q then uh, we'll implement we'll increment the query sum with the by querying the two fan victories if that's not the case we'll update it and finally we'll print it so this is how the solution uh, works enough this is how the solution is implemented like and share this video and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to receive notifications if i upload the video thank you